So I've gone ahead and done a, a few things. Now I've cleaned up the mess around here for the most part. We have a tiny bit of ethanol in here, but it's keeping us going. I turned off the desalination over here because we have enough water for now. Look at all the water we got here. That's plenty for now. Um, I put in a door here because we finally made it out to space. Finally, 156 cycles and we just put like one bunker tile here. I haven't done anything yet. That's where we're going to pick it up now. Um, but yeah, that's pretty exciting. Uh, this finally turned on as well, which is awesome. We've already collected... Wow, that's actually full. Okay, I need to make more of these. <laughs> Damn. So, yeah, let's just... Let's fill these up, I guess. Get as much natural gas as we can from here. Because we can use that for power. I've also gone ahead and I've connected this circuit. So I should take that off. Because we don't... I'm trying to reduce the amount that I use this now. So this is done. Now we only have... We only have three. <laughs> three circuits relying on that. And one will rely on this. Which is kind of nice. And considering how much natural gas we have here, that will be going for a long time. In fact, I should probably make more of these. It kind of, it sucks that they can only produce 800. Because that kind of limits how much, how much I can make from it. Because like this produces 2000. We are also getting a, a few more eggs now, by the way. Look at those. Damn. Because what I decided to do, I put in some extra critter feeders. I mean, sure, it would be great to get these stone hatches and get rid of the regular hatches. But... Yeah, I think for now, I'll just get whatever I can get. There you go. Pumping it into here now. This is making so much. Damn. Damn. Uh, I also built a couple of these gas reservoirs because there's too much carbon dioxide here. So much so that it was actually not getting through to this gas vent. So I did that. It's, it's freed it up a little bit. And this can continue. These are almost full, which is kind of scary. I guess I can make some more here. I don't know what to do with this carbon dioxide, guys. I don't know what to do. Let's have a... Uh, long hair slicks are in there. This guy is gonna die Because there's no oxygen here, so I think we'll just kill him sadly We're also gathering a bunch of natural gas here, so it seems as though that's gonna be my main method of power I will have to make a uh, separate circuits though because Obviously, one circuit is not going to be good enough. Oh, now these are full too. My god. Guys, please. <laughs> I'm going to have a, an absolute warehouse. <laughs> Holy crap. Is it actually... It's almost full in here. It's full here. Man. Okay. Oh, hey, are we out of salt? Ah, shit. Yes, we are. Okay, well, there was a bunch of salt over here, so I think it's time that we grab that. Let's just get all of that. That is a crazy amount of salt there. That will keep us going forever, probably. We'd be doing all right with what we had too. All right, so I'll just take you through what I've done here. It's kind of messy. <laughs> so basically I've got the natural gas going. I need power here. From here to here, to here, to here, to here, here, here. And then from there, it'll go all the way into here. 
And if this, I've got just a simple switch here, which they need to turn off. <laughs> uh, if that's off, it'll just stop there. If it's on, then it'll feed into this. So it's pretty damn easy. Yeah, so right now it's just going to stop there. And it'll... So what should happen is it'll back up from here and then go through there. Alright, we've got a fair bit of salt there. How much did we get? 31 tons. Nice. And there's still heaps more here, which I can grab if I need to. And we're still making some with this. Albeit, it seems like that's not really going to be enough. Oh well. Also, we should make some more paintings and stuff. Uh, reed fiber one. Okay. How come these aren't growing? Oh, there's no water. Okay. No problem. Food is doing okay. Yes, plenty of eggs there. That'll be good soon. So let's see if I can put my telescope. Oh shit, it's big. Okay. <laughs> Uh, Alright, I have no idea how this is going to go. It's probably going to end spectacularly, but we'll give it a go. I mean, the worst thing that can happen is it just gets broken. Hopefully they build this stuff quickly before it starts meteoring again. Uh, come on, guys. Also, was I supposed to get an achievement for getting to space? I don't even remember. Oh, launch your first rocket. Yeah, that's that's not going to happen. Not for a little while. Hey, look at this. Wait, gas intake? This needs oxygen. Come on. I should have looked at that, huh? How much does it actually need? Uh, 120 power... Steady oxygen supply. Yeah, but tell me how much. That's important, you know. Alright. Gotta take this all the way down. Man, this is far and very convoluted. Ah. Okay. Well, it's here. I probably will need to produce a bit more oxygen. I don't know. It depends how much it needs. How much does it need? Hmm. I think I'll just split it 50-50 here. That should be enough. Surely. Telescope idle. Okay. <laughs> well, it's going to take me a little bit of time to get that going. Uh, this needs power too. Yeah, it'd be great if I could get some... Where is it? Solar panels. Need glass. Okay, so I need one of those glass forges, whatever. Yeah, solar panels would be great up here. Again, I need to get more bunkers first. So, first things first. At the moment, I'll just leave this unhooked. You know what, I probably will wait till I, till I can get glass. Let's see if I can go about that now. What do I need for glass? From raw sand. How much sand do I have? 85 tons. Okay. I can do that. Does this get hot? Does it make sense to produce this? To produce sand all the way down here and then use the sand all the way up here? That sounds like a lot of work. Ah, <laughs> oh, that reminds me. I need to get plastic. I need a polymer press. So the petroleum goes in there. I reckon we can also make it come out here. This has got to go kind of around though. <laughs> Liquid bridge. I love plastic. I... I never really get to the stage of the game where I can use it though. 
Hey! What is that? Uh, hold on. <laughs> Bit overexcited here. Block a meteor from hitting your base using a bo- Oh! Hold on. You know what that means. Uh, let's go. Okay, I was worried that because there was no power that it would open, but that's good. No line of sight. Okay, well, it's closed. So what do you expect? What do you expect? I'm not going to open the star map until I'm ready to, ready to use it. So this needs a bit of power. Inductive wire. How much was on this? 1.4. That's fine. Uh, does this produce gas as well? It does. But what gas? Is it carbon dioxide or steam or what? I seem to remember it not saying. Steam. Okay. Well, steam is nothing around here. Just go out anyway. Just gonna... It's gonna melt into water. That's what it's gonna do. Put it there. Probably have to convert that into a high pressure gas vent at some point. But it'll just melt, go down here, and then probably freeze. <laughs> so, it's all good. Everything seems to be running a, li a little bit more smoothly here. I like it. Is this full yet? That's full. This is almost full as well. Natural gas, guys. Oh man. Okay, one, two, three and a bit. This is dormant again for the time being. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. I like that. We didn't end up making an extra circuit here. I've got so many freaking balls in the air right now. Uh, I guess we'll just use a transformer. I don't know how else to split circuits. That will relieve a lot of strain. So now my oxygen is disappearing, it seems. We have plenty here. That's good. Uh, ooh, okay. This is not really happening yet. That's fine. Yeah, I'm gonna have to step up the production here. I believe there's still so much here. I might have to make two different lanes, I think. Maybe add an extra few gas pumps. How much is this? Oh, this is gonna be, have to be converted. Has to be converted here. But yeah, if I can get some plastic going, then I can make some, uh, I don't even know where it is. Some tubing. Transit tubes. So this needs 50 kilos of plastic for every one tube. Yeah, we'll, we'll get there. We will get there. I can make transit tube access. <laughs> Alrighty. I reckon it'll just go here. Does that need power? Of course it does. Of course it does. We'll just send people down. They'll just go... Boom. And just spit out here. And I'll have another one down here. They can come out here. Alright, what did we get? Printables. Ah, uh, Yeah, we'll get that. I won't use either of them, but... Waiting granite. Come on, guys. Does this need... Does the polymer press need manual operation? I don't think it does. No, it doesn't. Okay. Good. So let's see, what's going to happen here? Nice! <laughs> oh look, it doesn't even affect it! It just melts here. 
We have, wow, frozen carbon dioxide down there. I'm pretty sure. Is it? Melting. I don't even know. Yeah, it is. It's carbon dioxide frozen. That's unbelievable. So how much plastic do we have? 120. Oh my god, this is gonna... I'm gonna need so damn much. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we'll probably need some ladders. Although, what's gonna happen? They're gonna open... They're gonna open onto... And all this stuff will fall through. <laughs> hmm. So, underneath... I probably need some window tiles or something, but I'll just, I'll get it functional for now. We'll dig all that out. Dig all this out. In fact, we probably don't need to dig this because it'll fall, won't it? So I might just put a robo miner on the floor here and then it'll do all the digging for us. Gee, we're running out of lead now. We use too much. <laughs> yeah, we actually use most of our lead. Oh man, there's still more that we can collect here. Uh. There's a bunch here. Oh no, it's it's because it's unreachable. Okay. So we still have a fair bit. Yeah, there we are. 56 tons of lead. Okay. Crisis averted. Wow, this is actually producing a little bit of heat. Interesting. But as far as like the temperatures of this goes, it's all fine. I'm glad that that doesn't freeze anymore. That was a major issue. And this goes back in here. It's it's slowly warming up. The oil. It is relatively cold. It's going to take forever before it boils or anything like that. Oh, what happened here? Overloading. Ah, oh, okay. Oh, that's annoying. I'm so sick of this. <laughs> we have some transit tube. Yay. Should probably make more of these, huh? Otherwise, it's going to take forever for us to get enough plastic. Overheated? What overheated? Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. That's... That is not good. That is not good. We need to get that set up as soon as we can. Maybe higher than six, maybe a seven. And dig that out when it's safe. I wonder if your dupes can die from being hit by an asteroid or a meteor. That'd be amazing. Also, I don't think the... Like, the oxygen is not really being sucked up from, like, here. Like, it kind of is, but it's not really. 300 degrees. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that will do it. It's because of this. The regolith that falls. Hopefully that cools down a little bit. It's broken. Nice. Wow, how do I cool it down? I mean, it's exposed to space. It should be cold. You would, I would have thought. <laughs> hmm. I'll deal with that a little bit later. It's not a massive priority. What is a priority though, is plastic. And we don't seem to be getting that much. <laughs> Camille. Have you gotten some more skills yet, Camille? Because you need that exosuit training. You're the only one. You're quite close. Also, your morale is terrible compared to, it's like half of everyone else's morale. <laughs> At least. How does that work? It's probably because you can never get to where you're going with the exosuit. Holy shit, the pressure in here is enormous. What is going on with this? 
Oh, it's not actually. We disconnected it. That's right. Whoopsie. My bad. <laughs> Completely forgot I had to reconnect that. There you go. In comes the natural gas. What's broken now? Oh, the telescope. But it's also idle. It's idle and it's broken. Okay. Well, I wonder, can they actually use it? No, it's not connected. Of course. Uh, yeah, if you could make those, that would be great. We have enough steel. We have enough. Alrighty, guys. I'm going to have to leave it there for today. Thank you so much for watching, though. Hope you enjoy the video. Hope you're enjoying the series so far. We're starting to get into the good stuff, finally. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.